Hey guys, this is Andrew How with How It Works. Um, this is a uh, direction on its boot menu, and I'm going to demonstrate and just show you guys what is inside. Um, and um, basically, this is the part where after you configured your BIOS, <coughs> you get to see um, exactly what you can boot into um, as long as your computer is able to, to load up the actual full uh, bootable. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started and just show you around what's what's in there and then have you guys decide and and um, you know figure out what you might use what you wouldn't use but all together it's all put together into a multi boot USB alright so I'm gonna go ahead um, and just show you around so here is how you actually get to the actual direction PE environment um, so if you like in the other previous video where uh, you were booted in and I showed you all around with the tools that's in that bootable PE um, this is basically um, how you get to it also in here is Dart 10 which is basically Microsoft's uh, PE um, so you can go through and fix Windows operating system issues um, data recovery um, Paragon recovery uh, those are more for legacy type computers, Windows 7 era. Uh, the next thing I'm going to go ahead and go over is Kali Linux is on here as well as uh, D-Band and, and K9. Um, again, this is meant for people who are going to be using uh, the forensic side of things. So network penetration, exploits, virus making, um, also just you know these are to be used only for ethical hacking do not use these for any type of abuse as again I am not liable for this um, for providing the tools they're free to download they're free to, to go and put on um, so DBAN though I have to say is a hard drive wiping utility so we'll go through and wipe out the um, the actual hard drives over and over and over to the point where it makes it impossible to recover data. Um, as of Hiron's Falcon, this is basically um, the other two alternative uh, major PE environments that a lot of people do know about. If you are into old school IT, uh, you would use these to kind of like fix Windows XP um, in some parts of 7. Um, so I've integrated those tools in so that you still have the the pleasure of being able to boot in um, alongside of uh, direction. Paragon Rescue Kit. Um, this is again just another type of tool that will help with um, you know recovery or um, you know whatever you could think of when it comes to Windows maintenance. Linux. Okay, so I got Linux Mint on here. Um, this is one of the tools I uh, use the most. It also has Gparted uh, built in. It's another great way of being able to um, manipulate Windows um, environment on an internal hard drive without having to uh, go through and have to fight with it. Um, so you can just like purge things. Um, I'm kind of getting ahead of myself. So antivirus tools. Um, some people like Windows Defender. I'm not a huge fan of it, but I integrated it for common use. Um, a lot of people say it's great to remove rootkit, so I went ahead and <laughs> provided that. Uh, again, this is to please the crowd um, than really what I would use it for. Um, that is pretty much it it's again a multi-boot environment um, you choose what you want to boot and you just go forward with it and um, you know this is again a pretty short video just to show you what is inside of it even if it's an older version of whatever it is that you're looking for you know you can always you know integrate what you want you just have to use universal USB um, and then add what you want to it um, other than that, that's about it. Thank you again, guys, and uh, hope you enjoyed the video.